So as most of you know by now, TikTok is a humongous app. Everyone uses it. Your mother probably uses this app. Follow me if you want to, first of all. I, I'm trying to grow my TikTok following up, but there's a humongous trend going on right now that I also made a couple videos about, that I also made a video about yesterday about exactly what I'm telling you guys to actually be careful about. And what this is, is pretty much the silhouette challenge on TikTok. So if you don't know what this is, pretty much, this isn't a good example, but whatever. This is a video, part of the video that I made. Basically, it starts off like a video like this of people just filming whatever. And then it shows a, like a silhouette kind of video, I guess, like a red little filter that kind of makes things look a little bit more obscure and a little bit more censored, as we thought. And a lot of people would show themselves in a little bit of a different light in this specific filter than this one. So I'm sure you all know what the silhouette challenge is. But now there are actually ways that I also demonstrated yesterday on exactly how to go ahead and go around this little filter. So if you're somebody who made this type of video and you actually made yourself look up maybe inappropriate, but more so, I'm not trying to get this video demonetized or anything, but if you went against TikTok's terms of service in any way in this specific filter, I think you guys kind of know what I'm alluding to. You need to go ahead and take this video down from you, you know, from your TikTok account. You need to go ahead and take this video down, mostly because you're going to be in a situation where if for some reason TikTok in their algorithm is able to do exactly what people are doing manually, which is like turning up the brightness of those things, and you're going against TikTok's terms of service, they're going to not only shadow ban your account, they're not only going to probably take down all those videos, but they're probably also going to ban your account permanently if you were going against their terms of service when you were doing this type of challenge or really any challenge. So I, this is just kind of a public service announcement. I would highly recommend anybody who did that challenge to actually go and determine if your video is fine, then don't worry about it. But if your video is actually something that's against their terms of service, I would highly recommend you to go through and actually delete those videos more so than even just people seeing it themselves. You can actually get your account permanently banned and I would not like that at all. But also this is just another public service announcement. Go through your whole entire profile right now and delete any videos that you may deem inappropriate. The last thing I wanna see from you guys is you guys getting your accounts banned for any reason. So I would highly recommend you guys to go through that way. So again, if you did this silhouette challenge thing, like I said before, I would recommend going through, deleting these videos. If you were going against the terms of service, if you weren't, then again, that's a totally different topic. But if you were, again, delete the specific silhouette challenge and you can go through with your rest of your life. So that's really pretty much it. Just a little PSA. If you guys have any other questions or anything like that, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button. That me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. Every single subscriber that we get really does count. So it means so much for you guys to get hit that. Also check out the other links down in the description as well. My Twitter, my Instagram, my other channels. More importantly than everything else, every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.